Bring, bring. Six five, colors, which could either be about the colors that are non-present in this district, or maybe about the famous fixes. Spoilers. It's most likely about this chapter and the lack of colors. The bus had emerged from the back streets into a rather quiet looking village. The fog was still thick and everything was still in that faded hue. Even the occasional sightings of pedestrians had ceased. The very idea of color variation seemed like an alien concept here. All I see are orange hued lights coming through the windows of misty grey buildings. It was as though everyone decided to stay indoors for the day. I can't even tell where we are or how close we are from our destination anymore. Have you been here by any chance, he sang? How? Oh, I. Well, districts are country sized. Or at least that's what it seems to be at this point. At first, well, I thought at first that they would be somewhat city sized, but considering that each district has its own culture, similar to a real one, and like a real country, um, I do think that we need at least. At least country sized. Also, considering that most of. What was it? What was the district you were in in Ishmael's chapter? Oh, my brain. I can't remember, but it's an entire ocean, so that's huge. He was the only other sinner who had spent a while in Teacorp, so I decided to ask if he recognized anything. But it was evident that the scenery was unfamiliar to him. 나는 최대한 사람들의 눈을 끌지 않으며 연구와 생업에 몰두하고자 하였지. 하여 티사를 그리 자유로이 오가진 못했소. I can't imagine doing any research at a place like this. Can't have been easy. 익숙해지면 괜찮소. 오히려 이곳에서 나고 자란 이들에겐 책이 있다는 것이 신기한 것이니. Oh yeah, being born here must be utterly fucking depressing. I mean, then again, coming from outside and then getting here must be more depressing because I don't know, do we need colors in our life to survive? I'm a I I am very fond of colors myself when it comes to looking at something. I like co colorful things. When it comes to my own like fashion sense, I I mostly tone down on colors, like lots of muted and dark colors like brown, gray and black and stuff. But I gotta say like a like good nail polish on a woman that kind of does it for me. 그리고 나는 잠시나마 기댈 수 있는 자들이 있었네. 이는 낯선 곳에 적응하는 데꽤 많은 도움이 되지. He suddenly looks away to a place far beyond from here. Memories of his past most likely. <laughs> 티사의 특이점이 어떤 것인지에 대해선 아는 게 있나요? 그곳에 대해선 특이점이 의뢰 그렇듯 나도 무어라 정확히 추론할 수는 없는 작동 원리라 함이 맞겠소. 다만 It's funny how most singularities are these huge mysteries yet at the same time their purpose can almost always be explained by the letter the district starts with like T Corp Time track. <laughs> they have to do with time. You know what I mean? It's kind of kind of obvious at times. R Corp. Replication. Granted, they're not called C Corp. They're not clones or something. It's because replicas. He sang paused and carefully began to speak. What about K Corp? Healing with K. That one's mysterious. Thank you, Rodian. Thank you, my spirit animal. 시간을 필연적으로 제어해야 하는 곳이라면. I'm trying to make sense of that before I read on. I don't think I can. 빛은 또한 색과도 밀접한 관련이 있으니 중국엔 
색과 얽히게 되는 것입니다. Yes, I do know that light is color and but, but... is it to do with the, sp the speed of light or something? Are they slowing down light itself? I've recently heard. I don't know where I got it from. It could be bullshit, okay? <laughs> Because lots of things on the internet you hear are bullshit. Like the earth is round and like and so on, right? All of this is bullshit. So I re recently heard that, oh, if you had time stop powers, it would be utterly fucking useless. Not because you couldn't move anything, but rather because you would stop light particles themselves and everything would be black. Is that true? I don't know. It does make somewhat kind of sense. But then again, if I think of time stop, I think of anime and hentai and I think of just using, using my power for not so pure intentions. <laughs> It's just kind of creepy. 제가 알고 있는 시간에 대해서까진 추론이 가능했습니다만 파우스트가 가진 티사의 특이점과 관련된 지식에 접근하기까지는 저에게 아직은 시간이 걸린다는 말도 덧붙여야 하겠군요. Wait. It must also be said that it takes time for me to reach Faust's specific knowledge. It it's so weird when she's talking about herself in third person. It takes time for her to reach It takes, like, the thing is, she's not specifically talking in third person. She, she's referring to, to herself in first person and then in third person. This is deliberate. It takes time for me to reach Faust's knowledge. Is anyone else gonna stumble upon that? Faust, known among us for, hmm, maybe, perhaps, rarely ever gave us answers this detailed. This is kind of weird. Can anyone explain this away? Like with with her first saying me and then Faust? Then now is the time to ask her all my questions. <laughs> I love the little exclamation mark at the end. Faust, yeah. If it's not time, then... Yes. This is the only thing I've done with the T-Sai. What? Why? Aww. I'm going to say it like this, but I'm going to put my hand on my hand. Yeah, Faust keeps teasing me with like all sorts of things. Well, I guess I should be glad that she decided to tell us this much. I doubt she'll tell us more no matter how much we pry. I wonder if this, this this isn't even the saddest fate of this in the city, is it? Mm, the forbidden fruit, yet in this case the forbidden fruit is something that should be granted that was taken from you immediately. Which makes this kinda kinda crazy. <laughs> 햇빛이 색깔까지 보이지 않는 건 아쉽네요. 하늘의 색이 그리워질 때는 많았어. 특히 약게 비가 올 때는. It's fitting. It's fitting that Isang was residing in this district, considering that he was not only searching for his wings, he was searching for his own, as Ishmael just put it, with the sun, his own vibrancy, right? 그래 그런 것들도. 각자 알던 하늘의 색이 있었으니까 쉽고 그리워지게 되는 거지. 처음부터 이곳의 하늘만 보고 살다 죽는다면 그건 불행도 아닐 거야. 그것까지 불행하다고 말한다면 오히려 오만한 게 되는 거지. 그렇게 생각할 수도 있겠네요. Yeah, they, they didn't even know better. The atmosphere in the bus suddenly became incredibly frosty. 아, 그거 해보자. 가장 좋아하는 색깔이 뭔지에 따라서 각자 성격을 알수 있다던데. Okay. Rodia, who was the one to chill the bus in the first place, was also the first to break the ice. 이상이 하늘색을 좋아하는 거라면 어디 보자. 고요하고 조용한 당신, 생각에 빠져 잠기는 걸 좋아하는군요. 오, 어떻게 하는 것이요? 그거 참 기묘한 재주로군. <laughs> Can't even tell if he's sarcastic. Oh, 
자, 차례를 기다려. 그 다음에는 파우스트. Is this gonna be the nameplate? 저는 잠깐 잠깐 무슨 말 할지 다 알아. 파우스트는 대체로 그런 걸 믿지 않는답니다. 라고 하겠지? That, that was a good impression. 그런 사람은 대체로 흰색을 좋아하더라고. 그렇지? 자기 머리색이랑도 똑같네. 그저 말을 아끼겠습니다. 나? 제일 좋아하는 색깔? 참, 뭘 그딴 걸 물어봐, 남사스럽게. 나는... 어. It's gonna be a color associated with Cathy or something. He pauses. A great manner begins to emerge into our view from a distance. I could immediately tell that this was the Wuthering Heights manner Heathcliff had mentioned. Um, I continue reading Wuthering Heights, but now only a few pages. It is a very, very hard read. Ooh, maybe I should read it in German, actually. It's it's the first book that is somewhat breaking me when it comes to that. Uh, there, there are some, some words that are just so foreign to me, so strange, and... Like some of the, some of the quirks of the writing with the apostrophes and stuff make it very hard for me to get through and understand what's happening. Um, do give it a read yourself. So inclined. I, I am still interested to see how many people actually know, read, or want to read about the source material. I should make a poll on that. I, I've I've stated so before. I should finally do it. Common sir. Black. Yeah. Good color. 모든 물감을 다 섞어버리면 나오는 색안인가? 그거. Actually, you get brown. Uh, actually, it depends on like what kind of color, kind of thing you, you're going for. But with like actual physical color and like liquid colors, like he's most likely referring to, it is brown. I can clearly hear that Heathcliff is muttering through gritted teeth. I have a feeling that black wasn't always his favorite color. 6-6, six, six, the makeover. I don't really know what to do with the the titles of these. They're just being so short and no introduction or description given anymore. Kind of makes it hard, harder to edit this than before. <laughs> Two things changed the moment the Wandering Heights man appeared over the horizon. We finally get a good look at the outside of our bus. More like a train. Right? Kind of like a train car. Cool. 거울 있는 사람 없냐? 야, 뭐 아무거나 내놔봐. 왜, 왜 이러시는가, 이스클리프군. 이 거울은... I, I wonder if, like, keeping up outward appearances was really important during the time he was there. One, is, one was Heathcliff, who was suddenly overcome with intense anxiety, and the other was the weather that grew dark and tempestuous all of a sudden. What a terrifying noise! 원래 이렇게 날씨가 구준 곳이었나요? 바람은 항상 거세게 몰아치긴 했어. 거의 폭풍 수준이었지. 하지만 이런 천둥이랑 번개는 뭐 워더링 하이츠의 날씨는 어느 쪽이든 꾸리꾸리 됐지만 멀리서만 봐도 저택이 정말 크네요. 침침한 눈에 카롯, 침침하게 도착. 번개가 번쩍 번쩍 눈 아파. This man looked as though it came straight out of a dark gothic tale full of mysteries. It's kind of cool. I was half expecting to hear a haunting cry echoing from its windows and maybe some gargoyles and shit. So are we just waiting for Virgilius to go off the bus again? 안 그런 적이 없지 않았나? 그래도 지금까지는 지부거나 회사였잖아요. 이번에는 그냥 저택일 뿐인데. 자, 내리지. 나와 카루는. 이번에도 밖에서 기다리고 있겠다고? None of the sinners were hiding their dissatisfaction with Virgilius. Some of them were even standing with their arms crossed. Wow. The audacity. 다들 표정을 보아하니 단체로 할 말이라도 있는 듯한 모양새군. 무디는 아닐세! 감히... 아무튼 아무 생각도 하지 않았네. Well, maybe not every sinner. We've gone through a lot of things, survived various trials and tribulations, tribulations that could have been easily handled, but had Virgilius been there with us. 
So... Looks like Ishmael decided to step up as our representative. She is like the class president of, of the Limbus company, right? He's not doing much guiding, or if he is, if that is his guiding style, then it's very less a fair, I think it's called. Very nice for her to say we're all in the same boat. Remember, it's Ishmael. Julius held his silence for a moment. His brows were not as furrowed as they usually are. It was the only indicator to me that he wasn't as offended to hear this as I thought he'd be. Ismael. This is a massive step. This, this is like a massive, again, character and group dynamic progression. And there must be. Sorry, there must be a reason for that. There must be a reason why it's left to Dante and the Sinners. I wonder if the Sinners themselves have something to do with the Golden Bowers. I mean, they're always drawn to them. Weirdly enough, they're not always they're not only drawn to them, but they they also have something to do with the Sinners and their past. So of course, there's a connection. It's it just seems so. Well. It's hidden still, the connection. We know that it's there, it's very clear to see, but we can't connect the dots properly. Why are the sinners connected to the branches like this? Why? We know where we need Dante, he's there to, to revive everyone. But why and how is he connected to all of this? Well, he's most likely getting something out of that as well. All of you could promise your wish. Maybe he did the same. Hmm. Did he just admit to trusting us more than he used to? Dante, can't hear me. I can say whatever the fuck I want. Hmm. 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 We can bring you as a corpse if you want me to. Oh yeah, right. Every single one of our elaborate plans to dress him up in fancy clothes fell through. Hey, you don't look that bad. I mean, it's clearly, like, the manor clearly isn't the place he's supposed to be. 
He's not like one of these nobles or elites or like perfect, pure and haughty human beings. They must have tried very hard and they must have criticized every single thing despite him trying so hard. But that's why he has this massive trauma of not being up for it. Not being good enough for it. Yeah, that's a good that's a good strategy. <laughs> Looks like Heathcliff is the only one who's taking this seriously. <laughs> oh no. People accuse me of making light of the story, yet sometimes stuff like this happens. <laughs> 뭐 살만한 곳이 없으니까 아쉬운 대로 사둔 걸 써야지. It would be really nice if they changed the sprite. Like accordingly, if he really does get to wear something else. Or if at least if we get a lot of CGs of it. 뭐, 설마 전에 둘이 어디 갔다 온다 했을 때 어, 아니 근데 그때 과자만 한 바구니 사 왔길래 과자들은 눈속임이었어 히스 물론 그중 몇 개는 내 일용할 양식으로 잘 써먹었지만 <웃음> 비록 제가 집에서 썼던 브랜드들까지 찾지는 못했지만 이만해도 어느 정도의 멋부림은 낼수 있을 거예요 <웃음> 베르 훈훈한 분위기 이어가게 이번만 눈좀 감아줘 응? 유니폼 말이야 회사 유니폼을 입고 오랜만에 애인을 제외하고 싶은 사람이 어디 있겠어 그치? <웃음> 그래도 저 길잡이가 용케도 허락을 해주게. 그러지. 뭐? 또 멋대로 작당해서 뒷문을 들락거리는 건 피하고 싶으니. 정말이야? 길잡이! If you tremble like he was about to give a chillies a big hug. 자, 히스클리프 씨. 이제 눈을 감고 무릉 도원이라 생각하면서 편안하게 몸과 마음을 맡기세요. You know what? I would. I would let Rodia and Honglu do anything they want to me. Aww. I didn't know I needed chibis. Yet here they are, they're quite nice. Oh, now I need more of that. Thank you. Sometime later. <clears throat> wow. He does look vastly different. In Germany, we have like this proverb. It's like, Kleider machen Leute. It's called. It's basically, the clothing makes the man. I think that's... Uh, that must be like a, like a similar English one. But that's literally what it translates to. It looks alright. I mean, I like you more in your usual style. It's just personal preference, but it looks good. Well, he shoved it up his ass. <laughs> Thank you for asking. Did you want it? <laughs> Why does she have to pronounce it so funny? They're even playing it up in the text. Ice cream! Yeah, <laughs> My friend is such a nice name. Oh, here we go. There, there, is, there is actually pretty much one to one the same proverb in English. Clothes really do make the man. Interesting. We're not so different. Them and I. The, the, 
the Americans and the, the, the Englishmen and and the Germans. <clears throat> okay. Good. So, Heathcliff, I've been meaning to ask this question for a while. I wanted to know the answer, but couldn't bring myself to ask him. Why'd you leave, Wuthering Heights? It's where the love of your life lives, isn't it? Dante, what? Am I really this incredibly tone deaf? That's a very nice track. Uh, holding my finger up as if telling you to wait, let me listen. You can't see this. Heathcliff, who'd been busily moving about and preparing to leave the bus, suddenly comes to a halt. Oh, it's such a good track. It's, it's the one out of the trailer, isn't it? It looks somewhat similar to Mersold, I think, right now. Heathcliff did not elaborate further. Neither did he need to, come on. Perhaps it wasn't that he didn't, but that he couldn't bring himself to. I didn't dare ask him what he was about to say, so I simply nodded in response. I... I see, which I don't really, because I have no eyes, but yes. Karen's words must have, must have hit him hard. It took quite a bit of convincing for Heathcliff, who was severely discouraged by Karen's remark to exit the bus. Interesting, the progress is completely locked. I didn't even notice before. I've asked um, on stream, which doesn't matter for you watching this right now. I've asked on stream how many stages there are in this first phase of, of this chapter. And apparently there's like 21 or something? 21 or 22 if I remember correctly. Uh, not a lot of filler fights, supposedly. Just lots of story, which... Well, if, if I get like a story time episode like that, like we're currently having, I'm okay with that actually. 6 7, the front gate. This is weird. The massive gate alone feels downright intimidating. That's one big front door! The gate alone feels downright intimidating. The massive gate alone feels downright intimidating. The massive gate alone feels downright intimidating. The massive gate alone feels being one of the children of the house or being as he has said being abused by basically everyone in the manor right <laughs> oh he's gonna reveal that his house is like three times as big or something some were teasing him, and some were genuinely surprised, but it didn't matter to Yifcliff. Every word he spat out was dripping with venomous spite. That was so loud! Wait, 
텅 비어있던 밤하늘을 순간의 섬광으로 가득 채워주고 사라지지 않는가 그 대신 자기가 가진 모든 걸 내보내서 모든 걸 불태워버리지 Did you know that lightning starts from the ground up? I don't know if that's bullshit or not <laughs> I could hear some forest critters fleeing spooked by the thunderstrike <laughs> it's just a fucking squirrel. Oh my god. Yeah, we haven't seen much regarding nature, like actual. Good nature, like I'm not talking about the outskirts, that is natural as well, I guess. But just proper and positive nature, like non lethal nature. Do you, do you catch my drift? Like forests and stuff? It must be hard. It seems like space and um, just. Yeah, just space in general seems very scarce, despite the size of the city. 그렇네. 싱크레온의 Jesus Christ, are you fucking serious? <laughs> Did the scribble in front of them just get fucking obliterated by lightning? <laughs> Don's face is amazing. Oh, that's beautiful. Ishmael is completely unfazed, although she looks somewhat sad about it, but... The shock. Wow. Pretty good. A little squirrel that could, but then couldn't anymore, that may have once been Heathcliff's tiny forest friend. Why was it so close to us? Squirrels are not that... that, like... Uh, brave when it comes to humans, as far as I'm aware. It was immediately scorched down to a pile of ash the moment it crossed over into the manor's front gate. Are these the security measures they, they spoke of? <laughs> Hmm. Right, Heathcliff, ready to knock on the front gate? I don't think anyone would want to now. Oh, okay, another CG, very good, like that. He sat blankly at the front gate of the manor. Well, they did somewhat invite him, right? If he does knock, then logic should dictate that they let him in. If Cliff takes a deep breath before knocking on the front door. Also, the gate is far away from the actual manor. Knocking like that should... Maybe they just didn't hear him. Oh, I can fix you. You, you make the, like a little, like a little puddle of corpses on the bottom. I can jump down to, and then I'm gonna gonna fix you right up afterwards. Heathcliff was a whole bundle of anxiety before he knocked on the front gate, but 
Perhaps this perceived slight reverted Heathcliff into his usual angry self. Yes. Despite his efforts, not even a soul stood beyond the front gate. None of us really believed that anyone would come out to greet him. But... I hear a horse. Oh no, it's not a horse, it's the gate creaking. <laughs> the front gate began to creak open as though someone was answering his place. I, I, would, I would love to end this episode here, but considering that the next stage is called Nelly, and I'm just absolutely curious to see this Nelly, uh, considering that I think Nelly is like the butler girl or something. It seems like a good butler girl name. Um, we're continuing with 6-8 Nelly. Interesting flowers. The heavy rain and the tempest only grew harsher the closer we got to the manor. How many stories is that? If we go by like windows, it's very hard to do because these windows are like... Is that perspective? Why are they almost two stories high? <laughs> if we say like that's, that's a ground floor. One. And then we have like Maybe two, or maybe this is the second one. Three, four, five. Five, and then like some. Some spaces up above with like tower like expansions. That's a huge building. The bubbling excitement of the sinners when they disembarked the bus had all but disappeared. A silent air of apprehension surrounded them as they gingerly took their hesitant steps towards the manor. In the midst of this aura of uneasiness, only Heathcliff seemed to be preoccupied by something else. The rest of the sinners were... I think continue to blast the earth as though it wouldn't be satisfied until it's reduced every living thing on the manor grounds to a pile of ashes. Hmm. Is there something in the Odyssey about lightning? I can't remember. Ah, Ochomyon, 크기가 커다란 저택일수록 더 효과적인 보안 장치들을 설치하곤 하니까요. 아, 저희 집에서도 보안 장치에 대한 이야기가 저녁 식사 이야기 거리로 올라오곤 했던 것 같아요. 아, 말이 안 되는 건 아니네요. 그렇다고 이런 사고 방식이 이해된다는 건 아니지만. LCCB 팀이 접근하지 못했다던 보안 책이란 것이 혹여. 네? 하지만 저희는 초대장이 있잖아요. 안심하고 걸어도 될것 같다는 소리예요. Is it really all this is? This is just one of those normal security measures that every rich family supposedly has. 하지만 조금 신기하긴 하네요. 날씨를 조정하는 시스템은 비효율적일 정도로 어마어마한 금액이 들어간다고 해서 직접 본 적은 없었거든요. Hmm. I remained silent because I didn't want to concern the sinners with something I wasn't sure about. But the closer we got to the manor, the, the more confident I became that something was off. Like a gut feeling or something? It is ex because <laughs> Dante doesn't know better, right? He, he has no knowledge of the world, really. He knows about as much as we do, maybe a little bit more because things are happening off screen. 
That is extremely abnormal weather. Isn't the work of some security system? This absolutely has something to do with a golden bell. Yeah, he has good gut feeling when it comes to that, I guess. But this golden bell feels different from the ones we've encountered before. How could it be different? Like We've encountered ones that have resonated with others before, so it could be that. Like If we assume that it, it's resonating with Kathy right now or something. It's a bit more chaotic. Sinclair was right. The manor's garden was slightly littered with flowers. They were the only things of color in this dreary sight. Well, they do look very nice. Heathcliff quietly gazed at the patches of violet flowers as he sang news out loud. Really looking forward to this Kathy character. I mean, it must be like she must be a weird, sadistic bitch. <laughs> Yet at the same time, she's the only thing he's looking forward to inside this manor. So maybe she's not too bad. I don't really understand. If Cliff appeared so doleful that I felt as though he had built a tall or packed wall between himself and the world, I could not bring myself to ask further. He did not tell us the name of those flowers. Oh. Someone hurriedly runs this way from the manor's front door, holding a lantern. Oh yeah, yeah, I need to see her in color, but yeah, yeah, the hairstyle, the maid outfit. Mmm, 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 that gets the lambda seal of approval from me. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, so there are people in here that have, that have cared about him. He's a chief butler, even. Bullied by a what? I hope we have color inside the mansion. Right? This Nelly regarded us with a curious look. As though she didn't quite understand what we were supposed to be. <laughs> hey, we're Limbus Company! We are his entourage, that's right. And that's another way to put it. <clears throat> well, the Facebook request is pending. ชิงกุ้ยพอมีเรื่องอดีตกับจุลนิชิคากุยสุดจีตตระท่าพี่อันนี้ทาร์ดะครับครับครับจุกุลปนามัวมันเมียปนินาเกี่ยวกันโซจ
돈을 내서 가져온 거지만 저택에 걸린 이 랜턴들이 있으면 색을 돌려받을 수 있다던가 오우 본래의 색을 밝혀주는 랜턴이구려 꽤 값진 기구일 텐데 그래도 완전한 색을 돌려받지 못해? 어딘가 칙칙하지 어. 그런데 캐시는 어디? 히스클리프 지금까지 어떻게 지낸 거야? 어? 잠은 어디서 자고? 밥은 잘 먹고 다닌 거 맞아? 좀 야외인 것 같은데 Yes, yes, she's perfect. She's perfect. I take it. 어? 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 넌 나는... 그래도 너무 늦지 않아서 다행이야. 다들 널 기다리고 있었거든. 다들? 그러고 보니 옷차림이 못본 사이에 달라지고 아주 멀끔한 신사가 됐네? 친구들도 많이 생겼고. 뭐... <웃음> 아이고, 그래? 그럼 멀리서 보면 하나도 못 알아보겠다. And he was talking so fast that Heathcliff wasn't spared even a second to get in a single word. Nelly...라고 했나? 정확히 어떤 사이지? 우린 그의 소중한 친구이자 동료이며 전우들이라 어떤 사이인지가 무척이나 궁금하군. Otis is like a fucking spy and a half. She's just taking to this like, like a fish to water. Otis was conspicuously scanning the interiors of the manor. Suddenly asked Nanny the most transparently suspicious question that I've ever heard. Ah, 나는 말이지. 어 히스클리프에 이를테면 보모라고 해야 했나? What? Is she a hat? <laughs> Staring at Miss Green in shock, shock and excitement. A weird mix. 보모요? 그코 흘리고 있으면 닦아주고 옷 갈아입혀주고 하는 보모요? 밥을 먹기 거부할 때는 밥을 떠먹여 주기도 하고요. 아이 넬리 그런 식으로 소개하지 마. 보모라고 하기에는 조금 달랐잖아. She seems more like a big sister type to be honest. 우리 어렸을 때부터 서로를 알고 지냈어. 그리고 난 넬리를 하인처럼 부리거나 보모처럼 따르진 않았거든. <웃음> 그리고 지금은 엄연히 치프 버틀러라고 내말 한마디에 군기가 바짝 드는 버틀러들이 얼마나 많은데 뭐 네가 제일 일을 빠릿하게 잘했으니까 그런데 나 슬슬 인내심이 금방이라도 끊어질 것 같아서 말이야 넬리 Cliff must have wanted so badly to ask her where Caffey was 연애는 언제 시작이야? Are there going to be tiny bombs in the food or something? Instead, he hid his true question behind a mask of aloofness. But... Uh, Nelly's expression became somewhat odd upon hearing Heathcliff's query. He called off. Hey! What are you doing with the dog? 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 Was a furious voice echoing from down the halls. Nelly, 잠깐, 방금 그 목소리. 아 참, 안 그래도 막 왔어요. 히스클리프 들어가자. 모두가 널 기다리고 있다고 했잖아. Heathcliff bit his lips anxiously and followed Nelly. 파티라는 듯한 분위기는 확실히 아닌 것 같은데. Damn, I know they're gonna end this stage in a second, but I'm so curious yet at the same time I can't keep recording. <laughs> 네. 그때 크루즈 파티나 이곳에서나 아무리 감추려고 해도 말이죠. 공간에서부터 나오는 음침한 분위기는 숨길 수가 없더라고요. 평소에도 활기 찼던 저택은 아닌 듯하다. 청소를 급하게 했지만 오로지 손님 맞이를 위한 용도일 뿐. 곳곳에 균열이 있고. 보수가 필요한 부분이 보인다. 또한 하, 즐거운 파티를 기대했던 건 아니지만 마음이 제법 슬프네. Followed on Kikyo to the halls, she appeared terribly disappointed. 